love the little components of it that actually help people remember to do these things because like with CDLs and physicals, the guys know enough to go do it, of course, because that's their job, but they don't turn in the paperwork. So maybe it's the day of that it's due. You get an alert that says, hey, your license is expiring today, you can't drive. And then you inquire and then you find out, oh yeah, I did that 10 days ago. And so it just helps us from things falling through the cracks. And I think it's very helpful for us. Like I said, all we had was a spreadsheet and stuff on paper. These are the things we train, but no real system of maintaining it. So I think it's helped in that respect that we now can maintain it and we can stay on top of things. And, and it alerts all the users, alerts the supervisors. We can run reports to get that data out. So there's a lot of nice advantages to having an alerting management system. We do have different formats, you know, whether it's an activity or if it's an assignment, or if it's a credential, how they need to access it. And I know with our city manager's office, when they roll out training, they've kind of changed the, the way that they approached it. In the past, they would do assignments. The last time, this push this year, was they decided to do it in credentials. We have different equipment that will have vendors come in and demonstrate how to maintain the equipment, how to do different things, and then they'll shoot video. So then I would turn around, take that video, import it into the system, and then, okay, now we now have Camel 1200 training. So even though the guys had it one time with the vendor, if they've forgotten some of these gauges or whatever they have to know, they can just go and re-watch it, and it's great. I really love that part.